Hey, what's going on? Happy midweek special. Get over the hump. Got a question for you. When your tank is empty, what do you do? When your tank is empty, what do you do? What do you do? Pretty simple question, right? When your tank is empty in your car, right? Tank is empty in your car, whatever you're driving, what do you do? I know what I do. Go to the gas tank and fill it up. What do I do? I fill up my tank. What do I fill it with? Gas. Why do I fill it with gas for the car? Because that's what it says to do. It says fill it up with gas. And guess what happens when you fill it up with gas? Fill your car up with gas. Or if you have a diesel, you fill it up with diesel. If you have electric, you plug it in. But if you fill up, you fill up your car, you fill up your truck, you fill up whatever you drive. And guess what? Then, then it's full. And then guess what? Then you can actually go about your day and do what you need to do, right? And your car, chances are, if you fill it with what it needs, don't fill it with diesel if you have a gasoline, gasoline tank. Why am I even sharing this with you as I'm standing here at the gas station? Because it's kind of like the same thing when it, when it comes to how do you, what happens when you're on empty? What do you do to fill your tank? See, as a health and fitness coach, one of the biggest struggles I find is people not taking the time out to actually find the way they need to fill up their tank. And what happens if you run a car on empty for too long? And if you ever tried it, I know I have. You try to run it for too long and you see how long you can run it for before what it will happen. It'll die, your car will die, it'll die out. And if you're not careful, it can actually seize the engine and your engine can break. And that's exactly what's gonna happen to you. If you don't fill your tank and here, if you fill it with the wrong stuff, does this make sense? Is this resonating? If you don't fill it with the right stuff, it's gonna break. If I were to put diesel in this gasoline tank, it's gonna break. It's gonna seize up and I won't be able to use it. That would be dumb, right? Nice car. It's kind of like your body. If you put the wrong things in your body, the wrong fuel in your body, it's gonna break sooner or later. It might not now, it might not in a week, it might not in a few years, but sooner or later it's gonna break and it could cause problems. So my question is to you is how are you filling your tank? What are you filling it with? Are you filling it with garbage? And, and I'm not saying you have to be a, a perfectionist at this, but you have to start somewhere. You have to actually first get your butt to the gas station. What does that look like for you and your health? You actually have to find out what it is your body needs based on what you're trying to achieve. If you're trying to lose weight, don't just think by reducing the amount of calories you eat is going to be the only thing that you need to lose weight. That's not the whole part of the equation. And I don't really know what goes in, in the gas. I know gas is gas, but I don't really know what all the stuff is in there. But I know the people that made gasoline, right? And the guys, the automakers that make the cars and to make it how it figures out, they know what to do. Just like I know what to do when it comes to people and helping them with the food and the fuel that they need to fill their tanks. And listen, stop running on empty. Why do you think stress sometimes gets, you know, even overwhelming and anxiety and, and your body just goes to like, just kind of crap, it just falls apart, is because probably either you're not taking in enough fuel, you're taking in too much fuel, or you're taking in the wrong fuel. And I'll tell you what, I'm about ready to, this, this, my tank is full right now, so right here, the tank in the Jeep is full, I'm about ready to go fill my tank, what are you gonna do? Listen, if you have no idea what that looks like, why don't you send me a message, hop on a call, we'll talk about it. And here's the thing, I can tell you, I can promise you, if you learn how to fuel yourself the right way, it's just like putting gasoline in, in a car that requires gasoline. You'll be able to get the results that you want and you'll get in the best shape of your life. Just as my Jeep's gonna take me where I wanna go, the right fuel in your body will take you where you wanna go. Take care, God bless, we'll talk to you soon.